So where things are at, I'm going to go ahead and start to drill some holes. I'm going to mark the, the inside and the outside right next to the uh, gorilla bracket. So kind of mark on the cross member where the inside and the outside is. What I've done here is just put a couple skinny pieces of, of plywood. They're, they're like, I think even half inch or less underneath the gorilla bracket just to, just to prop it up as well as this clamp. And so I'm just gonna hold it and we're gonna just use the, the gorilla bracket as a guide to drill the hole into the cross member Double checking, making sure that I like the alignment of the cross member left to right. I know side to side, this is where I want it. I just want to make sure it's left to right. Go straight in and punch it through. Okay, that's, that's the top skin. I'm going to go ahead and put a... Uh, a collar on this so that I can cannot go too far and that is a little uh, a stop collar on this 5 16 drill bit so I'm down to the top layer I need to go another eighth inch but I'm gonna go about another quarter inch through and all that I'll go ahead and punch this through the next layer Uh, and just put one of your three inch bolts into that drill hole and it just becomes like a a keeper that hole and keep it uh, where it needs to be by taking this clamp off and just trusting on the other hole and the Push on that, looks feel solid. I'm gonna lift up on it though, just to make sure it's tied up against the grill mount as I'm drilling. I see a nice orange circle underneath there, so we got her where we want it as a uh, locator keeper. Really not going anywhere now, so um, won't hurt to just clamp it though, just temporarily keep it up. Hmm. Use that same clamping method over here. All right, um, it's it's tied up against, and I'm just looking at it and making sure it looks square. Going for it. Okay. And then one more here. We have located the cross member with respect to the gorilla brackets, but we haven't finished this side. But we've kind of done what I'd call, you know, the technical work. From here on out, what we're going to do is <coughs> measure <coughs> from the center over, duplicate that measurement over here, cut it off at the eight degree angle, um, deburr it drill the holes with the tooling, insert the end cap, and then the cross member is basically ready to be put back together. And then we're ready to put this baby together and put the eight degree legs on and get ready to rock and roll. So it's exciting. We're, we're getting close to the end here. So uh, before I, I take anything apart and go and, and do the machining work, 
inside. Uh, I made quite a debris field of um, aluminum chips here and 